The Daily Win is sponsored by Bacardi Fusion Flavors because... Mm -hmm. Johnny Manziel can't win. He flew coach in the middle aisle on a flight to Las Vegas and even took his playbook with him. You could easily celebrate him for being a studious young professional. But now, now, going to Las Vegas means he's not serious about football and flying in the middle aisle means he's not a baller. Your hot take on Johnny Manziel doesn't have to be rational or logical as long as it's negative. Johnny Manziel could rescue a dying kitten by the side of the road, nurse it back to life, and the only thing you'd hear is, I don't want my quarterback to be a cat owner. Cats are a sign of weakness. You want to be an elite quarterback, you got to own a dog. Which is kind of true. Hey, shut up, Brady Quinn. Oh, you want to go on SportsCenter and tell Manziel how to be successful in Cleveland? If your 12 career touchdown pass thrown ass knew anything about success in Cleveland, the Browns wouldn't have drafted Manziel. And shut up, Mike Wilbon. Oh, Manziel in the middle seat should embarrass all of Cleveland? What's embarrassing is a former journalist shouting in hyperbole because he no longer has the ability to provide analysis or reasonable commentary. Douchebag. And shut up, Jimmy Haslam. Here's a tip, no one is confusing Cleveland for Hollywood. Oh, heaven forbid the Factory of Sadness has a bona fide celebrity in its midst. Do us all a favor and shut up until the day you go to federal prison. Peace. So yeah, I'm on Team Manziel, rooting for the guy who's catching footballs on a jet ski. He gave us a fusion of gridiron and water sports. Thanks, Johnny.